Formula One returns to Bahrain again this year. Formula One is really a battle um, between the government who want to show the world that things have returned to some degree of normality and that things are okay, and then between many of the people who are being discriminated against, uh, that they've been targeted. And the Formula One week represents for them an opportunity to get Bahrain and uh, the human rights violations back on the international agenda. And as usual, more you know, international journalists will be allowed into Bahrain this week than any other week during the year. We hope that reporters will take the opportunity not just to cover the, the sporting event, but to also show some of the reality around the, the political unrest there. You really ought to be aware, if, you're, if you support the Formula One, uh, that having the event in Bahrain is likely to result in human rights violations, which otherwise would not have taken place as people get rounded up. Protest leaders get arrested in anticipation of them uh, protesting before the event. Don't be fooled that this is uh, a country in reform, it's a country in turmoil, which looks no closer now to a political settlement than it did four years ago. If you'd like to know more about Bahrain, visit our website, humanrightsfirst.org.